Good day guys, today I'm just recording with my phone, I wasn't planning to do this but I'm out at Granadan Fry North in our um, newly planted Grenache vineyard. I'm just picking up a few vine guards that uh, the wind has knocked down. Every time I'm out in this vineyard um, I'm always amazed by the, the soil here uh, which is so diverse and when we planted this vineyard we found so many uh, crystals it's full of pink quartz and we always knew there was something special about these soils but today I literally just stopped my motorbike here to pick up a guard just behind me and I was just looking at this single panel next to the motorbike and I found five or six different types of rocks just here literally next to these two vines I found this so there's a bit of um, chalky really sort of soft um, easy to break soil here and the majority of the the topsoil at least is clay rich um, slightly loamy where I am but it, it's very shallow uh, but it's made of uh, this sort of marl or clay with some harder rock limestone calcareous rock through it but then on top of that, I've also found this, there's not many out here, but I've seen them further down in the vineyard. It's sort of black, almost like, I don't know how to define them, almost like schist. Uh, just very, very dark, very compact, very heavy rocks. And then of course, everywhere, it's full of these pink quartz. Uh, we've got uh, majority, I would say, of the, of the rocks that you see sort of surfacing um, are quartz. And then also, there's plenty of these sort of almost granitic, just very old uh, rock formation, which is quite special. This diversity hopefully is going to show in the glass once we make wines from these vineyards. Um, it's, it is though quite special in a region that is probably more famous for it's sandy loamy soils um, soils that are probably more suited for a richer more fruit driven style of, of wine we have the chance to work with soils that are very depleted uh, just very poor soils in terms of nutrients very draining soils all of these all of these harder soil components are gonna translate into more minerality, more precision, wines that are a little bit more focused and that's kind of what we want really from our wines. We we don't mind a big you know generous Barossa, Shiraz or Grenache or GSM but we are transitioning more and more towards styles that are um, more about the elegance and the subtleties and that's what we we want from this vineyard and I think it's gonna deliver. Thank you for watching. Catch you next time.